Peace, everybody. Now, Facebook and your fan pages. Okay, I know everybody wants to get, you want to get a lot of likes on your fan page. Fan page. Now, a lot of times, the way most people do this is that they will send out invites to people on their friend list and they'll ask others to send people there to like the page. Now, I don't do that anymore. I used to do that. I used to send out, you know, to all everybody on my list. I stopped that since 2000, the late part of 2013, I mean 2014, when the last time I did that was with my movie, Diary of a Bad Man, which won the uh, 2015 uh, Jamaica Film Fest for Best Narrative. When you send these people to your page, because they didn't come there on their own accord, you probably are not going to get any activity from them. So when you continue to post different things on that fan page, most likely they're not going to engage in it, opposed to the person who came there on their own merit. Now, so what I say to people who want to increase their fan page likes is that you got to, you have to, you, you have to put content on there. You know, you got to do videos, you got to do posts, you know, you got to be active on your Facebook page in order to build the likes and build the, the eyes that are going to be uh, looking on your page. Now, what happens with the average person is that they don't realize that you have to build. And this is something that, I, you know, I think Damon Dash said it. He says, you got to build your audience one person at a time. It's like building a house. You got to build it one brick at a time. And a lot of people don't want to do that. They want to have this big large audience immediately but you got to engage you know give that quality get that quality um audience meaning that audience that's going to stick with you and the only way you're going to get that is that you have to engage with your audience so if you want some if you want someone to watch your movie you got to engage if you want someone to listen to your your music you got to engage if you want someone to do download your app you got to engage. Facebook has a lot of um, useful tools to help you reach your audience, you know, and um, what you have to realize is that you have to pay attention to what you post up. And just because you think it's hot, just because you think it's good, that's not guaranteed that everybody else is going to see, see things the same way. So it's just like me, I have um, various different pages and there's things that I put up as far as one of the characters that I do. I do this Nigerian guy called Emonefe and Certain things I put up of his, I found it funny, and people didn't find it funny. And the, th and the things that I don't find funny that I just do like, hey, I'm just doing it, <laughs> and not expecting any results, that's the ones that get, get the results. So it, get, it, lets, it allows me to see where I should be, what I should be focusing on doing more. So you got to look at that. And Facebook has a lot of tools for you finding your audience. But what I find with a lot of independent artists and independent filmmakers, they don't want to give up a little bit of this because it will take a little bit of this to find your audience. Um, I just want to show you one of my fan pages, some of my fan pages and just show you like some of the likes and that I have. Not all of them are that high because sometimes I do lack in putting content on there. But I noticed that every time I put content on my fan page, I attract more likes more likes is more viewers more viewers and more likes and individuals can convert into actual um them making t taking action on whatever it is you want to sell or what they or whatever you is you want them to to um respond to okay so just check this out over here so over here this is my page you see my back right there i'll show you my back right there so okay that's for the ladies right look at that look at all those rips anyway we're not here talking about that look at my son copying but we're gonna go to some of my fan pages right so see more so i got all these different fa fan pages up here so let's look at this one this one over here is the adventures of emonefe the adventures of emonefe and this page, I never, I never sent anyone out here to, to like my page. And um, I have 245 likes, right? And two likes this, this week, this week. Even though I haven't done anything on this page for some time. I think the last time I was on there was November 25th, 2015. And if I go down here, before that, oh, look, before that, 2015 was March 8th. Okay, 2015. And if I go down below that, March 2nd, 2015. And below that is um, February 16th. So 
I'm not even as active as I should be on this page, but I got 245 um, plus two likes this, you know, this week. And if you look at my numbers, some of the numbers that I have on views, 6.5 over here, 2Ks in views reached like 9,000 people. And there's, um, there's one on here that I, I, I didn't even um, really find funny but people found it funny and it's like reached almost 70,000 people 15 15k's and views 148 shares you know and that's just me not even doing much you know so if I get more active on, on this this page I'm gonna go into the to the hundred thousands I can even I can even see myself getting into the millions with with um this um this uh page basically so um let me see more so if I go to uh, this other one um, which is loud thoughts. This is an, this is another page that I have that I've created, and it's just for me to um, to share thoughts and stuff with people. And um, as you see over here, I have thirty seven likes and uh, for this week. So it's just something that I've just started, really. This one, and I've been just like putting certain things up here, you know. So um, that's my camera going off. You know, so you got to be active. You got to put content up. All right, people. So, um, peace. Ain't nothing like, ain't nothing like, ain't nothing like it. Oh, ain't nothing stopping me. No.